Hello, and do we really even need an introduction for today's episode? I don't know if we do, because y'all already know the drill. It's time for some more Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. We're back for another episode, specifically episode number four. In the last episode, I don't even know what the fuck happened, but I do know that we are supposed to go to Orberg City. So, I believe we're on the way to do that, because we are in, I, I think this is Orberg Cave? Forgive me, but I have to check to make sure. Orber Gate. Alright, but quick team recap. We got Kasumi, level 10. She is a tiny little Badoo. Mild nature. Ups her special attack, lowers her defense. It's pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good nature. She has poison points, so anybody that tries to uh, touch her, get up off me. Poison. You're not fucking with her. She's rocking Absorb, Growth, Stun Spore, and Worry Seed. Pretty trash moveset, pretty mid, pretty mid, pretty mid, all things considered. Next up, we got Wukong, rocking Scratch, Power Up, Punch, Ember, Taunt. He's level 12, he was our starter. And then finally, we have Scar, rocking Tackle, Lee, Thundershock, and Charge. These two Pokemon down here are not going to be used. They are simply there because I am trying to complete the Pokedex as I go through this game with you all but um that's most likely not gonna happen and i'll probably have to do that off screen but without further ado let's go ahead and walk right past this dude and battle him because you know when your eyes meet with another trainer it's time to battle but oh looky there you got a poke edge hmm you're still a pretty new trainer aren't you but it's all good you're a fellow f <laughs> you're a fellow friend of pokemon so, let me make a gift for these technical machines for you. Never mind, I thought we were gonna battle. He gave us TM98. Each of these TMs contain the move Rock Smash. FYI, when you use a technical machine to teach your Pokemon a move, the TM will then break. So think very carefully about when you to use it. I've also added a new feature to your Poke Edge, Rookie Trainer. It's the hidden moves app. Okay. Use Rock Smash from your Poke Edge on a wild po- And a wild Pokemon will get rid of boulders on your path. So it doesn't even have to be my own Pokemon, it could just be a random wild Pokemon? Interesting. But to use this hidden move in the field, you'll first need the gym badge in Orberg City. I'm looking forward to seeing your growth. Nice. Okay. Okay. All right, can I, uh, let's see, can I use it? You can't use it on this rock. So what kind of rocks can we use it on? I don't know, but we're in a battle now. We'll figure out what rock it is, but, um, Camper Curtis, yeah. Come get this ass beaten. Come get these chestnuts. Yeah, we are leading with Kasumi, I forgot. Intimidate doesn't matter, we are a special attacker. Y'all know the drill. Y'all know the drill. Uh, so that's the one thing about like Pokemon games. Especially like in early game. Unless you are just using your main or your starter as like the one and only Pokemon. A lot of the times, these battles can go for very long because you're not doing super effective damage just yet. Everything is just neutral. And all the moves are weak. You're low level too, so that doesn't help either. It's an interesting dynamic. But like towards middle, like the mid stage or like the end of the game. Oh, poison. Okay. Poison's gonna kill him. Nice. There's that ability kicking in. Already coming in clutch. We told you, get up off Kasumi, man. Get up off her, man. The same what you want. The same what you want. You touch Kasumi, you get poison. Y'all know the drill. What the fuck? Oh. <laughs> A Geo dude. Alright. Alright. Let's see if this actually. If this doesn't kill him, I will catch him. Yup, alright, we got it. 
Oh, he has sturdy stats. Okay. That's good to know. That's good to know. This is definitely not a Pokemon that is going to be added to our team. But it is a Pokemon I need for the Pokedex. So let's go ahead and throw this Pokeball. One. Two. Three. Yes, sir! Geodude's data was added to the Pokedex. Nice. I don't need to give him a nickname because it's not, not a Pokemon I plan on using. So. Oh, okay. So these are the kind of rocks that you can destroy, but... My dumbass forgot already that we can't use the HM because we don't have the gym badge. Already, I already forgot. I already forgot. That's crazy. Yep, this one has sturdy as well. That's gonna save his life. This should kill. Oh, this is gonna kill 100%. There's a 100% chance that Geodude dies. And there we go. And there we have it. Kasumi level 11. There we go. There we go. She made it. Magic card level 8. Uh, doesn't matter. These Pokemon are not on our team. Geodude level 7. Why did we get so much experience? I don't even remember the level of that Geodude. Okay, we gotta fight this little girl and we should be out. We should be out after this little girl. I'm just a little concerned because we're we're low on absorbs. That's um very concerning. Oh she has a Badoo of her own. Well, if I sat here and fought this Badoo, absorb versus absorb, we'd be here all day. So I'm gonna actually switch out to Wukong right here. And uh hopefully one shot with Ember. Ember should one shot. There we go. Scar is level 12. Wukong is almost a level 13. Scar wants to learn bite? Hell yeah. Forget a move. We can get rid of. I'd say get rid of Leer for now. Because Leer isn't going to be too helpful. Tackle can help when we have, um... Oh, she's about to switch to Psyduck. Alright, Kasumi. Now's your time to shine. But Tackle can be helpful for when... Like, let's say they resist both Dark and Electric. Then you have at least normal... I don't know what Pokemon would resist both of those. But... Not off the top of my head, at least. But, um... A ground, I guess a ground steel type? Well, then it, it resists normal too. What resists dark? Huh. I actually cannot think of it at this moment. What the hell resists dark? If anything at all. I'm pretty sure something out there resists dark. Maybe fairy? Is there an electric fairy Pokemon? There definitely is. The Dene's electric fairy. But the Dene is not in this game. So we have nothing to worry about. <laughs> I say that now. Watch Pachirisu be a fucking fairy electric. I don't know if they changed Pachirisu. I don't think they did. Pachirisu should still be mono electric. Howdy trainer. If you don't have a single gym badge, other trainers will look down on you like you're a total noob, right? They added that to this game. <laughs> so I'll show you where the town's Pokemon gym is. I wonder if that was an original, like, line in the game. Huh? There's someone there. Kanan. Which, by the way, I totally misspelled my friend's Kanan's name wrong. But, uh, he gave me his, yeah. It's supposed to be K-A-I-N-A-N, -A -A but 
I fucked up big time, so... Oh, it's you, Jamon! You finally here! You're finally here? You're slow as hell. <laughs> You're so slow, the gym leader's been gone. He said he had to go, uh... Oh yeah, to Oberberg Mine! I got my badge already, so it's no big deal to me, but, uh, you? <laughs> You're still a total noob, bro. <laughs> Definitely, definitely, definitely. We're definitely lacking because Kasumi took her sweet time. A different nature, like personalities. I don't think it's surprising to see Pokemon in different colors. Ever heard about shiny Pokemon? They have different colors than usual. For instance, Pikachu is usually yellow, correct? Well, a shiny Pikachu is sort of orange. Can I get this Pikachu? Like, are you giving him to me? I would use a Pikachu. I use Pikachu in my uh, Let's Go. That was fun. Because of <laughs> the starting Pokemon, whether you got Eevee or Pikachu, is like OP as fuck for some reason. Oh, we got a Dusk Ball. Interesting, interesting. Yeah, he's right. Okay. I'm sorry for not, like, reading the text out loud. It just, it saves time, and a lot of the times, like, these people don't have anything particularly useful to say. Have you seen the vents? They release steam from down below. Like, you see what I mean? Like, what do we gain from that? <laughs> what exactly do we gain from that? Do you have a Pokemon called Machop? Will you be able to, or will you be willing to trade your Machop for my Abra? No, I will not be willing to do that. I can't do that because I don't I don't have a machop, lady. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. You see what I mean? Like it's just a bunch of pointless banter. So he's looking for a Zubat. The view is good from up here, but it's a pain going out. If you don't mind, how about showing me a Pokemon called Zubat? Okay, so somebody write that down in the comments. Be sure to come back to Orberg City and bring him a chop and a Zubat. If somebody will actually remind me of that, that would actually be so helpful. Alright, ooh, these fat ass. <laughs> these just absurdly large men just chilling in the Pokemon. Netballs? pause but uh i don't think they are particularly useful for the pokemon that i want to add on my team i don't think so so roark is our town's yeah roark that's such a weird name but okay so it is our rock type gym that's what i thought so how did that grow that girl with the starly was like, I got my badge. How did you meet the rock type gym with a normal flying type? That's... That's interesting. He had to be going easy on her. He had to. Okay, yeah, let's... Let's, let's definitely fix our team real quick because... We need to uh, get this sorted out. We need you to get the fuck up out of here. Abra, you need to get the fuck up out of here as well. And Geodude, you definitely need to get the fuck up out of my face. Nice. Now, one of the main things that I am concerned with is that I do not particularly remember how Badoo evolves, let alone Roselia into Roserade. But I'm pretty sure that is just like one of the stones, like a shiny stone or something like that. I'm not, I don't really remember, but I guess only time will tell when, you know, when the time comes. Because if, if Badoo does evolve through level up, then naturally she will just, she'll just evolve as we keep playing. But, um, okay. I always have a rotten time trying to decide which moves my Pokemon should learn. Hiya, your Pokemon could use some toughening up. Why not training in Orberg Mine? 
That's a good point. We should go there because the gym leader is over there. But we just got a great ball. You see, this is why you speak to everybody. This is why you speak to everybody that you can. And that guy up there, he looks particularly important somewhat. The whole system is taking the coal out of the mine and automated. There's nothing backbreaking about it. Never mind, he's just. It's just a nerd. <laughs> he had nothing particularly useful at, at all, actually. Which is crazy, crazy. I kinda wanna go in here. What is this? The fossil museum? Yes, this is where you would give them your fossils. Okay, so... You guys don't have to mention that in the comments. I'm pretty sure I could remember Orberg City is where we resurrect our fossils when we get there. Okay, um, let's talk to you. You need a bike together. You don't have a bike? There's a cycle shop in Eternal City. Yeah, well, we haven't been to Eternal City, so fuck off. There we go, there's a Machop right here, but we don't need to trade with that girl. We already have an Abra. So, I might just catch this Machop for myself. I might just catch this Machop for our Pokedex, you know? I don't particularly need to trade. Now, maybe if I, um, if I didn't have an Abra, I would consider... But right now, it's not even, not even a concern of mine. Not even a concern, bro. Not even a concern. That kind of looks like my cousin Troy. I ain't gonna lie. I should nickname him Troy. <laughs> I should. I ain't gonna do it to him. Got another Pokeball. So we essentially got that Machop for free. That Machop was free 99. We're at a wild Geo, dude. I think we could just run here. It wouldn't be too particularly useful to just kill that Geo, dude, right there. We will let her live. We will let her live. She will, she can see another day. Everyone is proud of the mine. They're digging for coal for coal under the sea as we speak. It's amazing how they do it. Nice. Chop, chop, ma chop, chop, chop away on rocks. You see why I don't like <laughs> reading everything that they say? None of this is really useful. You're taking a tour of our coal mine? Wonderful, that's excellent of you. It's always good to learn about new things and broaden your horizons. Like, they put a whole NPC in that house for what? To tell you absolutely nothing, mate. Oh, look, there's a Machop right here. There's no question that this is hard, hard work. But working alongside Pokemon, it gives me a boost somehow. Here, take one of these. I can appreciate that. A super potion? Hell yeah, dude. Give me that. Give me that. I'll take that. I need that. This pile of dirty sand is called a slag heap. It's a waste of from sorting coal. And that was a waste of time, bro. Like, damn, bro. I thought somebody, ooh. Let's catch the Zuba. Actually, we have to catch the Zuba. I might fucking die here. This thing, like, <laughs> double resist my stab. This thing is flying poison. That is quad resistant to grass. All right, we're still at the point in the game where you can just throw a Pokeball, full health Pokemon, and still catch them. That's good to know. All right, well, never mind, guys. It looks like you don't have to remind me anymore to go back and uh, talk to those people. Because we're about to do that right now. If I can remember who I need to talk to. I think it's in here? Mm, absolutely not. Uh, Maybe in here. 
Let's check to make sure. Let's check to make sure. You should be up here. You should be right here. Yup. Oh, that Pokemon. That's a Zubat. Wow, that's cool. It's so cute. That does it. I'll go out and catch some Pokemon too. Thank you, my friend. This is a token of my thanks. Alright, we did all that for a heal ball. I can't say that I'm, I'm particularly too... Trade your Machop for my Abra? I don't want to do that, dude. I can't say that was particularly worth our time coming back here. Damn, did we talk to her? I think we did not, but she's such a unique NPC. I was like, I've never seen somebody dressed like that. Hold on, she might be important. But alas, no, she's not. They never are. That is a fucking onyx. Wow. <laughs> okay, buddy. I'm going to need you to stand the ball. Smackdown? That's a new animation. I don't remember that. Okay, you have Sturdy. I was about to say. Like, I knew he had Sturdy, but I thought, like, yikes. You really gonna die like that, bro? You know, an Onyx or a Steelix would not be bad to use on a team, but... I simply cannot do it. I simply cannot do that. Pokemon is just so bad. There are no redeeming factors of Onyx whatsoever. I don't care what anybody says. There's just, there's just none. There's just absolutely none. Would I want to give this Pokemon a nickname? Not right now. Not right now. Only for the Pokemon that I plan on using while I do that, but... An X defense you never know, man. You never know. Those might come in handy. I can name a specific time where I think this will come in handy. But we're gonna wait till we get to that point. I hope I don't have to do it. But if it ever comes down to it... Everyone who works in the coal mine keeps their own Pokemon with them. You may be challenged to battles. <laughs> okay. So those NPCs were pointless like, yet again. Yeah, I think I'm gonna throw up a repel because <laughs> we keep getting bombarded with all these wild Pokemon that I don't really need anymore because I've already caught them. So in order to do that, you would just go to your bag and then spray the repel as soon as you find it. It should be... Yeah, right here. I was gonna say, like, I know for a fact I got fucking repels. I know for a fact, big dog. You wanna battle? You wanna battle? I'm gonna let you on a little secret. I stuck my Pokemon to work. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Worker Mason, Smuggler Mason. You snuck Machop to work when everybody else has a Machop? What is particularly illegal with you and this Machop to where you can't normally bring him? Who knows, who knows? Oh yeah, fighting resists dark. So if we ever came across a ground fighting type Pokemon or a fighting electric type, which I don't think either one of those types exist. That would be interesting. Why is there no ground fighting? Or ground or fighting electric? Oh god. That was a crit. Holy shit, dude. This Machop is out for blood. I don't like that. Machop is level 8. Machop learn revenge. Yes sir, yes sir. Alright, nice little potion. I should probably use that right now. But the gym leader is right here. Oh, 
Okay, stand back and watch this. <gasps> Using the hidden move Rock Smash, get rid of get rid of the boulder blocking your way. Fallen boulders need to be smashed so they're out of the way. If you could get the badge from the gym in town, you'd be able to do this too. Of course, you'd have to beat the gym leader first. That'd be me, bro. Ha! <laughs> See ya! <laughs> okay. Another battle. Interesting. But now that the gym leader is going back, we can go back and battle him as well. But we have to make it pass to all these people. Of course. We gotta make it pass all these people. God damn! This motherfucker did not have sturdy, and we just got all our health back. Good job, Kasumi. Good job. Good job, Kasumi. Onyx? We're gonna stay in. Kasumi doesn't care about any of these Pokemon, bro. She really just doesn't. She just doesn't care. Onyx didn't have sturdy either. He probably had, like, Rockhead or something. Kasumi just doesn't care, bro. She just doesn't care, Worker Cry, Colin. She just doesn't care, bro. She just doesn't care. We got an escape rope. Maybe I should use that. Oh yeah, I should definitely use that. <laughs> I should definitely use that escape rope. Yes sir, we out. Y'all know the drill? Okay. The fell the Pell's effect is gone. Let's go ahead and heal up. Take these Pokemon out of our party. And then uh We should be good to challenge the gym leader. Look at this man, we had a full party. Even though that team would be totally balanced and fair. Like that like, this could be an actual team that would be pretty balanced. You know, you got your grass poison, fire fighting. Electric, fighting, flying, poison, and then ground rock, I believe. There we go. But, like, we don't need to do any of that. I also want to switch Wukong with Kasumi. Even though this is a rock-type gym, and I might be putting myself in a bad situation, we literally have power up punch and we've never used it. And so this might be a Okay, let's talk to the guide. <laughs> Howdy! How's it going, Champ to be? That's what I said to a really impatient boy earlier too. The gym leader he the gym leader is a user of rock type Pokemon. Well listen, rock type Pokemon really hate water, alright? They're also weak to grass types. Gee, they sure have a lot of weaknesses. But don't think it'll be easy. You don't get to be the gym leader without covering for weaknesses. Going after a rock type Pokemon with a fire type Pokemon won't be easy either. That's all the advice I can give. Thanks for listening. Alright. But he doesn't know. They nobody in here knows that we have a fighting type move. And that we don't care about rock types. Youngster Jonathan, send out your geo, dude. I have power up punch. I'm gonna punch him in the fucking face. Look at his ugly ass face. Power up punch. Yes, sir. And it's only gonna get stronger. Defense curl? Oh, we're playing the long game, aren't we? Somebody's trying to play the long game, huh? Somebody's trying to play the long game, huh? Okay. You going for defense curl again? You're gonna have to. The next one's gonna kill. Tackle, you're dead, bro. That ain't gonna do nothing to me. Sleep, bro. I'm sleep as hell. Yes, sir. Get up out of here, bro. Get your ass up out of here. Thanks to Jonathan, never stood a chance, bro. I'm sorry. 
You never stood a chance, my brother. Alright, so after this guy, we'll go back, heal up, and then we'll fight the gym leader. These dudes and their Geo dudes, no pun intended. But Wukong doesn't care. He doesn't care. He just doesn't care about any of this shit. I wonder if we'll be a uh, high enough level to evolve by the end of this gym battle. My attack keeps rising, bro. That's why this move is so, like... Damn near so good in the beginning of the games. Like, he's switching to Onyx, bro. It doesn't even matter, like, at all. Because this is probably going to one-shot unless you have Sturdy. Oh, never mind. Didn't one-shot. I mean, you're dead next turn. He's fine, he didn't even go for a rock type move. Rock type move would have got me through there. There we go, super effective. Wukong is level 14. Now let's go heal up. What? Wukong is evolving? Alright. There we have it. He's evolving. I didn't think this would happen at level 14. For some reason I thought it was 16. But it's probably Turtwig that evolves at 16. Wukong is now a Monferno. Yes, sir. He wants to learn Mach Punch. Yes, sir. Bro, get rid of Scratch. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. Mach Punch is just the fighting version of Quick Attack. I, but I think Quick Attack still has higher priority than Mach Punch. Or maybe they're the same priority and then whoever's faster just goes. It, you know, however that works. But, um... We're definitely gonna, yeah, we're gonna cruise through this. I don't even know if I wanna, yeah, all right, we'll use, I'll tell you, I know what I'm gonna do. I know what, exactly what I'm gonna do. We're gonna lead off with Kasumi. We'll lead off with Kasumi because she needs all the experience that she can get. And for the last, like his ace, We'll bring out our ace. How about that? That sounds like a plan. All right, that sounds like a plan. We don't fight the gym leader like this because we are his equal. So, before we do anything, you must always save your game because only you, as a wise man once said, only you can prevent lost save data. So here we go. Wow, they put me in front of him anyway. <sighs> oh, welcome. This is the Oldberg Gym. I'm Rorik, the gym leader. I'm but one trainer who decided to walk proudly with Rock-type Pokemon. Ugh. As the gym leader, I need to see your potential as a trainer. And I need to see the toughness of the Pokemon that battle with you. Alright, let's do it, Rorik. Don't ever look at me like that again, bro. I'm about to whoop your ass. Come on. You got three Pokemon I got. Don't ever look at me like that again, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. I'm about to beat your ass. Zero dude, bring that ass. Here, boy. Bring that ass. Here, boy. Kasumi said, bring that ass. Here. She almost one-shot that nigga. What the? Stealth Rock? Yo, he is playing the long game. He, he heard me. He said, you bringing out that Monferno? Hell no, you not. You not bringing out that Monferno. Oh uh, yeah, that's gonna kill. Yes, sir. There we go, Kasumi. There we go. 
get all that experience, girl. Onyx? Actually, no. This is... <laughs> Onyx is a rock ground type Pokemon, right? He's not just rock yet, is he? Yeah, use Absorb. Yeah, use Absorb. Use Absorb. Yeah. What you gonna do? Rock throw? Oh, I'm glad I didn't switch. I'm pretty sure my would have died. Use another potion, bro. Just take the L. This is not gonna kill unless it crits. Can I get a crit? Almost. We got our health back. We got our health back. Oh, yeah, yeah. How is this Onyx faster than me? I just thought about that. What the fuck? This Onyx is faster than Kasumi. What the hell? Onyx is traditionally a slow ass Pokemon. Interesting. Alright, Kasumi's level 14. That's what we like to see. Craniados. Yeah, that's where we're gonna switch. We're gonna take. Oh, so much damage from this shit, too, man. Bro, stop looking. Oh, think you could take down the next Pokemon I sent at you? Go, Craniados! Bro, I'm about to hit this nigga in his fat ass, ugly ass head. Who has more power? They're about the same, but Power of Punch is gonna ensure that my power goes up. So I'm gonna go for this. Okay, we should be good, dude. Bulldoze? Oh my god. Our speed fell. Not yet, I'm not giving up. But look at this, Mach Punch. You lower my speed for what? It doesn't matter, I have priority. I have priority, dude. I have priority. Just like that, we beat him. Oh, what? That can't be my buffed up Pokemon? Crazy. Oh, that totally blows. I went and lost to a trainer who didn't even have a single gym badge. Oh, but that's the story. You were strong, I was weak. That's all there is to it. According to Pokemon League rules, I have to give you your gym badge since you beat me, the gym leader. <sighs> Here's your official Pokemon badge. Yes, sir. Put that shit in my to-go box. You heard the nigga who received the cold badge from Rourke. <sighs> Having that cold badge means you can now use the hidden move Rock Smash from your Pokedex. You should be. You should also take these too. They're TM76s. I'm gonna put these in your bag next to your chicken nuggets. Oh, actually, can I have one? Thanks, man. Each TM76 contains the roof Stealth Rock. You know, when you put out a bunch of rocks out? Yeah, that's what I did to you. It's a move that inflicts damage on opponents I switch into battle. It's really good and competitive. Some think it's OP. And these are stickers I use. Here, take some. I got these from the Apple store. <laughs> Incidentally, a TM will teach, teach its move to a Pokemon instantly. But a TM will break when you use it, so be certain you use it on a Pokemon and learn the move. And there we have it, folks. We did it. We got our gym badge. And that's gonna be it for this episode. We're gonna have to end it here. I think this is a perfect place to end. We beat Rourke. We got our gym badge. He took a chicken nugget from our, uh, from our parcel, our backpack, or whatever, you know, just a, you know, just a token of, like, sportsmanship, you know, yeah, bro, you gave me the badge, you can take a chicken nugget, bro, but yeah, leave a like if you enjoyed, comment down below, what Pokemon do you think I'm adding to my team, yes, yet, yeah, or next, I cannot speak, but the team is already predetermined, I just want to guess, or see if you guys can guess what we are having in store for the future team, but Leave a like if you enjoyed, leave comments down below, so consider subscribing, and with that, I'll see you in the next episode. Peace!